Hello, this is Elaine with Antelope Beads, and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a coil knot. This knot has lots and lots of applications. I'll talk about those in a little bit. Just to start with, I'm going to show you how to make the basic knot. I have supply-wise here a piece of 10 millimeter flat leather, and that's what I'm going to work the knot around. And then I have a piece of 2 millimeter round leather that I'm going to form the knot with. You can use for your base round leather, flat leather, big leather, small leather, and you can use both leather and wax nylon cord for your knotting material. Supply tool wise, all I need are a pair of scissors and flush cutters and some glue to finish the knot with. So let's get started. I will have about one inch, one foot piece of leather here, and I will just fold and make a little loop towards the top. I'm going to lay this across the back of my base, back of my flat leather, and then I'm just going to start to coil around both the loop and the flat leather. And you notice I'm working up towards the loop. So I've started down here by the tail and I'm working up towards the loop. And as I get as many loops as I want, I'll stop and I'm going to put this tail through the loop. And here's my other tail and all I have to do is just pull these two pieces apart. And then I'm going to go ahead and actually just pull this knot right into my coil. Okay, so this is what I have from the front. I can just adjust that. And from the back, you can see that I have my two little tails tucked in there, which is why I do want to start from the back. To finish this, I will just use my scissors or flush cutters and trim the leather off right flush with the edge of the knot. There we go. And then I will apply a little bit of glue to my cuts right here. And again, right on this side. And then I can even take my fingernail or a pair of pliers and just tuck that tail right into the knot. And there is my finished coil knot. Here are just a couple of samples using that knot for embellishment. On this bracelet, we've used three lengths of five millimeter flat leather and we've, we have alternated coil knots over two of the strands and then finished with a coil knot around all three strands together. And in this piece, we have used a piece of five millimeter round leather and wax nylon cord to make our coil knots. And then we just wrap jump rings right into the coil knots as we went. So we had a place to add our little beaded dangles. I hope you've enjoyed this video, please visit us at antelopebeads.com to see a lot more videos, lots of ideas and inspirations. Thank you.